Good evening, Internet. Welcome back to another night of Strange and Scary Games. Tonight we've got Silvio Blackwaters, the sequel to uh, the Silvio games. I have played part one and part two in the past, uh, so I'm excited to see what this game is about. It looks like it takes place in space. Um, I really disliked the ending to Silvio 2, so I'm hoping that this kind of redeems itself. Let's go. Uh, what's settings? Quality high. I've seen a couple reviews that say that it's very dark, um, so I'm hoping that it's not too dark. Shaboskop and Dread XP present. A game by Nicholas Swanberg. Booty, 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 booty. jump is this our spaceship oh we need a combination it's too dark is that the same voice actress that's kind of cool doing here though there we go uh was the Freezer. How do I see the recordings? Oh, are the recordings just out in the environment? That's different. Okay. Hello. Hello. Mr. Obama? Juliet? Where are you? What, uh, what's going on here? Oh, okay. There goes the ladder. 
I guess I'll have to find another you way back. You have an incoming call. Hmm, I think the voice is coming from the watch. You have an incoming call. Hello? Hello. Oh, hi. Who are you? I'm Lee. Who are you? My name is Juliet. <laughs> are you here as well? Yeah. Are you alone? There were a lot of us. Then it was just me and George. Now it's only me. What happened to everyone? They died. And George? He died too. Where are you? I'm by the lake. I was just there. Do you know what the combination is? For the computer? No. I don't think anyone ever figured it out. Where did you find a watch? It was on the arm of a glowing statue. <laughs> That's not a statue. It's George. Oh. Why is George glowing? Because he's dead. Well, his body's dead. His spirit's still alive inside of him. Inside of the shell. How do you know? Because they talk. Use the watch. Left click to use the watch. Um, not in the office. It's too crowded. Do it outside. Fear of the lake. Sam made it all up. Because of his... Sam made it all up because of his fear of the lake. Use E... If you want to find more spirits, they're all down in the lungs. The lungs? The lungs of the planet. Follow the train tracks until you reach ground, and then go towards the glow. There are multiple ways to enter the lungs down there. Can I not get over there? I guess not. There's an invisible wall. This is a dried out lake, and the train tracks run straight into the ground. That's odd. Oh, there's a bike over there. What's with the, um, the recording quality there? of black on a flesh colored canvas. Another lake. And the water is glowing for some reason. This must be one of the entrances to the lungs that Lee was talking about. I should follow the train tracks. Looks like a trail. They've cracked open one of those glowing bodies. 
It's like a path leading through the forest. Who would do such a thing? Was it George? You're not allowed to touch the bodies. And certainly not crack them into pieces. <laughs> George wouldn't do that. So, we don't know where the path goes then. Or who made it. Guess not. Hold up. What is this? Underneath the tree. Does it go? It's a passage. The gravity will change. What? Where's the ladder? Juliet said that there was a ladder, but I don't see a ladder. I can't get through there. Okay, I can get through there. Except there's an invisible wall there. That's aggravating. Please don't break. Please don't break. Oh, there we go. I think we're in uh, MC Escher land. Why would anyone need a gun here? You know the glowing bodies. With time, the spirit goes bad in its shell. And at some point, it'll crack open. Then you need to defend yourself. Uh, when it breaks, shoot the the statue with left click. Pick up some marbles from the table. Load the marble with right click. Shoot the statue. Void spirits by shooting a marble statue before they attack you. How do I put my gun away? Did you? This is how you live? In complete darkness? There was a sun once, but it became smaller and smaller. And eventually it disappeared altogether. So what happened to it? We drifted away from it, I guess. And then it was just... darkness? Unless you have a watch to make the bodies light up.
It'll kill you too. Analyze video and collect drawings to reconstruct the lyrics of the song heard on the radio. Optional. I don't I don't need that anymore. So in the first game, she was using electronic voice phenomena uh, in like an abandoned amusement park. And then in the second game, it was a series of islands. Where are we going? I, I don't need that. Where's this ladder? There's got to be a ladder somewhere, right? Go away. There we go. So people would carry the bodies around? Like lamps? No, no, of course not. You don't touch the bodies. Why not? When people die, the bodies are left in their homes out of respect. When they start glowing, they're placed in the lungs, for safety. You don't touch them. Gun? Gun? How do I pull? Where's the gun? Where's the gun? Did I get it? I got it. Okay. Okay. Numbers work. Scroll wheel kind of works.
can't get over there. She'll drag. A slice. have been dangerous it's okay as long as you take your time you learn the roots I do like the gravity effect that's very cool doesn't look like statue or not okay you are though Ice. Yeah, 
shit. Here's Sam. Herself. You see that face again? How can there be trees without light? It's all mimicry. They're not real trees. They're not real? Nothing here is real. It's an artificial world. Made by who? I don't know. Your name. Go. I don't think it matters. How long was it only you and George? For a long time. Were you friends? We were close. I'm guessing it's he was found underneath a tree by her cabin. His face was blue. They caught her by her hair and dragged her to the lake. Hello. Can't get on that. Child was found underneath the tree by her cap and his face was blue. They caught her by her hair and dragged her to the lake. Thank you. 
Spreading. How did George die? He went swimming in the lake. It wasn't allowed. Why not? The whole area around the lake is forbidden to walk in. Did he drown? No, but he changed. Changed how? Mm, I don't know. He was acting funny. And then what? He stopped eating. And then he died. for humans to live in as a replacement for Earth. It mimics things found there from the understanding of something non-human. I had it right before. Hmm. The child was found underneath the tree. His face was blue. Okay, there we go. Found underneath the tree. His face was blue. They caught her by her cabin and dragged her by her hair to the lake. So we got our first one done. Spreading our loud. So you don't know who they are? They? The ones who built all of this. Why do you care so much? No, I find it interesting. They aren't here anymore. There's no way to find out. The stars. Is that a different path? I'm wondering if this is the wrong path. Guys, come in. Respond if you can hear me. Set combination. Juliet, Alpha, Delta, Romeo, Bravo. Same. <laughs> lungs one you found your way out of lungs one
I don't think these match. Uh, we can't go back. I'm worried we missed some stuff in Wong's one. Did you ever get visited by people from other planets? Don't think so. Like astronauts in white space suits? Nope, that doesn't ring a bell. Are you sure? I think I would have remembered that. I found an astronaut in the house. I got a vision, and it showed me the combination for the computer by the lake. I think there's a possibility that we can get out of it. Oh, but what's the combination? I'll keep it to myself for now. Well, what if you forget? <laughs> Give it to me. You know what? It was probably not. The combination even had my name in it. Just a stupid dream. If it was stupid, you can just say it. I'm going to find my way back to the lake, and we can try it together, okay? Okay. Do you know how I can get to the lake? Yes, I do. How do I get there? If I show you the way, you'll let me come along. Deal? It's a deal. Walk up to the office. There's a balcony on the back. Where is this? I see one. That's behind the wall. Eh. Get up there. Because of his. Eh. Don't break. I don't know which one is the office. Looks like we've gotten everything. Nope. Something over there. How do I get back over there? Interesting. Okay. 
Can I do the same thing over here? Nope. Okay. Stars with machine. There are a lot of these, aren't there? Eighteen. And Georgie's looking for all of them. happening anything else down here in the first game there was this weird uh, red mist um, and it was implied that there was like a family the family behind the um, the amusement park was doing some kind of experiments And so you never really knew what the red mist was. Um, but you always knew that it wasn't like great. I'm on the balcony. Right below you, that's the entrance to the lake. It's shut off, but I know how to open the door. How do I get there? There's no gate from the side you're on. You have to go through the lungs. And then in the second game, there was like a volcanic explosion. Where am I going? Now feel 
Get off. Get off. Thank you. That, uh, that was the weirdest podcast I've ever heard. Thought he was going to explode Where at me. Where do I go now? What? How do I get to the lake? No, I don't know. What do you mean? That was the deal. You show me the way, I enter the combination. You have to find your own way. Follow the trail. Maybe it'll lead you there. Maybe. Why can't you show me? I can't show you the way like it's a mushroom spot in the forest. You can't navigate in the dark, and I don't know what things look like. I can't explain the route. You have to find it yourself. Is that the, um, the voice actor from the Step Hair Studios games? He was tied. The voice sounds familiar, but I can't place it. But I remember. Felt so good. I got him. Did not get him. There we go. but the thoughts I really thought This is 
too dark. I don't know what's happening. Did we get it? Finally. That took forever. Why is that one so bad? Um, I really thought that Juliet had died at the beginning of, or at the end of the first game. Or had become one of the smoke monsters. But then there was a second game, and Juliet was still alive. And then at the end of the second game, she was visited by aliens. What did you think about George? He was my best friend. I didn't have many to pick from. <laughs> but he was simple, easy to be with. He was liked by everyone. Did you go along well with the others? Only George understood me. So I didn't I honestly didn't know if we were going to get a third one. I, I'm enjoying it so far. Like, it's different enough to be interesting without being too different. I'm scared of where the story is going, though. I would love some more marbles. Can I get um, a better gun? Is that like something you can unlock? Yeah. Get up there. Wait. I didn't even realize that it was a mural. Can I get up here? I can't. Okay. Can't get up there, though. Hmm. 
Come on. Come at me straight on. Got you. Black Waters. What's in the lake? Probably nothing. So why was it forbidden? People always want to smell the devil, but from a safe distance, you know what I mean? If you can't smell it, you'll feel empty. You'll make one up. The lake was their devil. Don't like that. It's weird that the songs are optional, but that we have to do the puzzle in order to get the um So you don't know who built all of this. The lights to come on. I don't know. And I don't care. But it's interesting to know. What was their intention with it? To make it feel like Earth. To make it feel like home. <laughs> Sam has been in a few of these now. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, it's all the way up there. Fuck off. It's too dark. Yeah, you do the puzzle and then the light comes on. Spreading our loud punishment by... I don't see why the things open if there's nothing in them. He's a handyman. He's a handyman. All right, we've already got that one. No, thank you. So the um, glitched out enemy is a little bit uh, 
distracting. Stop! Oh my god. Got it. Now the combat is a little bit uh, unrefined. I just run away from you. It's too dark. Oh my god. My biggest complaint so far about the game is just that the combat feels like it's not integrated into the game at all. Um, so yeah, I need to take another restroom break. I'll be right back. the executioner. Saw some sparkles. Where are they? Did the enemies despawn? Is that what's happening here? Because that would be great. Now I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go. Order somewhere, but I don't see it over here. Is it because I died? Is that what's happening? Okay, there we go. Yeah. 
All right, so I had picked that up, but I never solved it. So now can I go this way? No. I don't know if I'm ever if I'm any better off now that I've solved that puzzle. Don't know if that did anything for me. We already get that one. Here we go. I think that we are back on track now. over there. So we're missing one for the um for the pictures, the portraits. Okay, Jake, the landing pad is ready. There's not a sign of them anywhere. I'm taking a quick look around while you get ready. No, um, he left it half done. We wouldn't have been able to land on it like that. I don't understand. James, Charlotte, Adam, come in. Respond if you can hear me. 
James, Charlotte, Adam, come in. Respond if you can hear me. Adam, is that you? Can you say that again? Lungs 2, you found your way out of Lungs 2. Conversation. Probably talking to themselves. So the, it sounds like there are four astronauts, so there's probably going to be four lungs. Which means we're probably about halfway through. No fall damage, that's good. having some thoughts about this game. This is where we were before, right? forbidden. We haven't found three yet. just going up. No, this is back the way we came. Okay. Jump on the bike.
Where are we going? Come on. Here. What happened here? It looks like there was a fire. There was a fire. It started in the lungs, and it reached all the way to the surface. Who started it? It was George. Why? It was after the lake. He changed. Georgie didn't mean any harm. Was it George or was it you? for me. You've got something for me. Say goodbye, three, four, can, two, four. Hey, pretty bird. Are you real? Bird friend. Get away from me, get away from me, give me space. Got it. It actually is probably better not to reload because it probably saves on the can. Sheep. 
There's a witch, there's a witch, witch, witch. Can't move. Which way am I going? So there's two there. We can't get over there. Can't move any farther that way. Is there a ladder? There it is. I could hardly see that. Hey, bird friend. Are you still there? By the lake? I'm next to the entrance, on the surface. I'm waiting for you here. Just making sure you won't leave without me. You don't have to worry. You have a deal. I have a problem with trust. Don't worry. You can trust me. If you say so. Damn it. I really don't like the combat. Guy's obsessed with witches. through 
I would I uh, would really prefer the black orbs to the things that run around and you can't really shoot them. Majority of the song is just witch. Did anyone else go into the lake? Oh, people were scared of it. There were songs. How did they go? <laughs> I'm not going to sing to you. What were the lyrics? Hmm. It's on the bottom of the lake. La la la. Walk away. Be scared. Don't go in that lake. Stuff like that. Creative. So the bird is like a construct from the aliens, right? Smash, you're not smashing, okay. Miss the black orbs. Transition where everyone would just sleep whenever they wanted to, but then they created the sleep song. What was the sleep song? When Sam sang the sleep song, everyone would sleep. Who was Sam? And when Sam Miranda sang, his head was the most bloated. That's why they listened to him. You didn't like Sam? Of course, I liked Sam. Everyone likes Sam. Was he a bit full of himself? George was very fond of him. And you were jealous? Why would I be jealous? George can do what he wants, I don't care. I think you do. I think you should mind your own business.
Go ahead and tell me. Most of the song is which. And when Miranda sang, everyone turned away, used to the noose they obey. Take a shot every time he says witch. There's a witch, there's a witch. What do you do to keep busy? I swim a lot. You swim in the lake? All the time. But isn't it forbidden to go near the lake? I'm the only one around now, so I get to make the rules. My rule is that the lake is a good place to be. I don't think I trust this guy. What's up, bird buddy? Do you feel changed after going into the lake? I feel like a completely new person. Really? <laughs> no. 
Maybe you changed, but you just don't realize yourself. Maybe it has an effect on everyone but me. There are ladders from the middle to an inside of a surface. And on that surface there is a sun and a day and a night and a lake with black water. Interesting. Where am I going? Can't go that way. Voice sounds familiar too. I'm gonna have to look up the voice actors. Found your way out of lungs, for, lungs three. Sparkles. No more sparkles.
Where's this one? So each lung takes us deeper down. Is it? How do we get up there? There we go. Over here, it's over here. And this takes us back up here. Murder forbidden inside. I think there might be five sections because there are five masks at the top. I'm listening. What did you see? you people wouldn't believe. He is a Triceratops. (laughs) 
Oh, we don't have any marbles. We have lost our marbles. Okay, you're cool. Like, what am I doing here? Now we're talking, okay. Now I have a machine gun, ho ho ho. Take that. How did everyone die? They died in the fire. The fire that George started. That's the one. How did George feel about that? What did he do? He cracked open their skulls and put their faces on the wall in the office. Why didn't you tell me before? It wasn't like him. I didn't want to give you a false impression of George. But why would he do such a thing? I think he felt lonely. They comforted him. No, I mean, why would he set the whole thing on fire? I don't know. I think I've missed some weapons, because that was, what was that? Two, three, four, five. You can zoom. Interesting. Oh. Is there a shotgun I can get? That might be better. Oh, 
So, he went swimming in the lake, and then he started the fire. Something like that. Did something in the lake make him do it? I'm tired of your obsession with the lake. George did it. The lake is just a lake. And he told you about it? Yes, but I didn't think he'd do it. How did you survive? I was in the lake. Was the first time you were in the lake? During the fire? No. I was in the lake all the time. In the past, too? Wasn't that a big deal? That you swam in the lake? Wasn't it forbidden? Yeah. I didn't really tell anyone I was there. Okay, there we go.
Why didn't more people survive the fire? Well, because they were all locked up. Who locked them up? George did. And why weren't you locked up? I was in the lake. Uh, our friend is a bit sus. Story is a bit uh, sus. Did you know he was planning to burn everyone alive? I didn't think he'd actually do it. You find it funny? <laughs> it was so out of character. Saw some sparkles over here. Where did they go? Did I just imagine the sparkles? My girlfriend's son is obsessed with dinosaurs, and so I'm going to tell her about the uh, the dino world. It's too dark. How do you feel about everyone dying in the fire? They got what was coming to them. You're saying they deserve to die? I'm saying they tried to stop our happiness.
can't go on that. Nothing in there. All right. Okay. How did they try to stop your happiness? Me and George had something they didn't have. What was that? We had each other. Were you in love? Okay. That's the end of that. What? Okay, Lee. It's none of my business. I'm sorry if I made you upset. Okie dokie. What is going on with Lee? More importantly, where am I going? There we go. Can see it. There are so many enemies here. There's a thing. Right, go ahead and kill me. I'm sideways. I don't know if I can continue the game because it seems like I'm falling through the map. That sucks. I believe that that is the end of our journey because it seems that I am softlocked. doesn't look like I can interact with anything either. Oh, you can just turn enemies off. That would be so much easier. I should just do that. Right. 
So let's get out of here for now. We'll exit that. All right. Um, that appears to be the end of our journey. Um, unfortunately, I believe that I am soft locked and can't continue. Um, I like the gameplay loop of this. Uh, I like the level design of this. Um, the fact that you like get to play with gravity um, and the levels are nonlinear and you get to kind of like climb through them in different ways and different directions. It's very cool. Um, I like uh, Juliet. Um, I'm not quite sure about the continuation of her character from the previous games uh, because like um, in one, she's kind of like an adventurous, like let's go find ghosts in this uh, abandoned amusement park game. Um, and then in two, uh, she like her boyfriend is looking for her on this ship. Um, and she's like going around to different islands, like trying to set things right in this one. She doesn't seem to be doing like either of that. She doesn't seem very adventurous. She doesn't seem very like, I want to set things right. Um, she seems very like, I just want to get out of here, uh, which is kind of like a step back from her previous characterization. Um, the enemies are awful. Like I, I would prefer, um, like the dark figures from the first game, uh, or like the dark orbs from the first game, like the fact that they just run around and, um, they can kill you. Apparently if you die, you can get soft locked in the levels. Um, yeah, I just, I don't like the enemies very much. Um, the combat doesn't seem like it's worth it. It doesn't seem like it's integrated into the story very much. Um, I would prefer like if you were going to introduce new enemies to have them as like the statues, if the statues were coming to life and like moving around, that would be really cool. Um, I'm hoping that this gets patched at some point in the future so I can like finish it. Um, because I have a lot of thoughts about like where the story is going. Um, the game, so the first game didn't really include aliens. There was like a hint of them in some of the sections where like you were walking through the park and you would see things like spinning in the clouds and it's like, is it a UFO? What is it? Um, and uh, like um, the family, uh, there was all this mystery about what they were doing and what they were trying to do and what is Silvio, what is this red mist. Um, and there was all this kind of mystery and intrigue. You get, you have really good atmosphere. You have really good spooky atmosphere. I like that a lot. Um, this one didn't have as much intrigue in it um, as far as the environment goes. Uh, it is very cool that um, like you've got this story that's so very good. Um, she's trying to get it out and Lee is helping her and Lee, there's something seriously wrong with Lee. It, it appears. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, it's very frustrating, um, that, uh, the enemies kind of just jump out of nowhere and can kill you and it can apparently soft lock you. Uh, so yeah, those are my thoughts so far. Um, I'm hoping that there's a patch so I can finish this, maybe like get a, get the ending, figure out what's going on. Um, in the first game, uh, there were hint of aliens. In the second game, the ending was aliens and it came out of nowhere. Like it wasn't built up to at all. Um, I really disliked the ending because it just seemed like you wrapped things up very quickly in order to wrap them up. Um, in this one, I'm hoping that like there's an integration of like the first storyline where it was this family doing experiments on people and what is Silvio and what is Silvio for and what is the red mist, uh, and the aliens and like what happened to Juliet after the second game. So yeah, those are my thoughts so far. Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Thank you for joining me for another night of strange and scary games. I love you. I'll see you in the next video. Good night.